character to me is those intangible traits, dignity, honesty, commitment, loyalty, accountability, all of those things for my life define what character is. A champion of character, I would say, is an individual that's able to express some of those character traits, not just in words, but in actions, and uh, be able to express that not only on the court, but to be able to transition from off the court into real life and apply some of those character traits. A champion of character looks like uh, my nominee, uh, Coach Durrell Kearney. Uh, and I say that because uh, Coach Kearney has been around uh, the school district for more than 30 plus years. Coach Kearney has helped to form positive attitudes. Uh, we've seen uh, his students, his athletes return to school every year to uh, support his uh, work here in the school by participating in alumni games and making donations to the school. And some even giving testimony uh, to uh, how Coach Kearney helped change their behavior from negative to positive. In my program, accountability is a huge staple in what we do. We hold our players accountable. We discipline them when they need to be disciplined. And of course, we reward them for their level of commitment and discipline and accountability. If you come in our gym, you'll see one in, all in on the floor. You see it on our shirts. And, and that's just a brotherhood. We try to create a family atmosphere. And believe it or not, my players hold each other count accountable for what we do and what they do on and off the court. And I think the examples that the coach set in terms of how we manage players they're able to transition some of those life lessons that we get in practice or instill in practice off the court, into the classroom, into society, how they carry themselves, how they interact with people. Uh, I think a lot of that transitions from our practices, from our interaction with our players, and then you can see it manifest themselves when they're not with us and when they're out and about and being disciplined in the classroom. Kids and youth are very special. Uh, and they are more discerning in most cases than adults. And so when you see the attitude and the respect the athletes and the students have for Coach Kearney, you, you just know that's a good person there. Being able to accept not only the positive outcomes, but the negative outcomes, and being able to channel that, whether you win or lose, whether it's good or bad, being able to maintain that emotional stability, and. Uh, Learn from some of your negative outcomes and use them as a way to springboard you forward, not only in sports, but in life.